My name is John Darnell with 310 Ranch Life. We've had a lot of requests from viewers, followers on how we pick a ranch rope for a job that we're gonna go do for that particular day. In this video, that's what we're gonna do is we're gonna just ease through the rope shop and talk about each, each different kind of rope and what we use it for. The Senko brand is a fantastic rope and there's a couple of different applications that we use this rope for. When you start talking about polys, you are talking about a soft rope by nature. Our polys in general are going to be softer ropes. Certain polys are softer than others. There's not a specific lay like in a, in a nylon team ropes. They'll have uh, softs, medium softs, uh, hards. There's no there's, there's no standardization of those ropes, of a poly rope like that. You just have to know when we're talking polys, we're talking softer ropes. So within the polys that we carry, the Senko brand is, is our softest rope by far when it comes to, to a poly. It does have a weighted core to it and it depends on which rope you're talking about on how that weighted core is put into the rope. So. With that being said, first thing we're going to talk about is a three strand. All the Senkos pretty much are a similar feel whenever you first get them, whether it's the red, white, and blue trump rope, the Cayman, or the Pit Viper. They're all similar ropes. When you talk about three and four strands, uh, that's where they start to kind of differ. So when it comes to the three strand, red, white, and blue, we'll just talk about it because we've decided that Senkos across the board are similar. Red, white, and blue are the three strands typically have two strands of lead running through three of the strands. So with that being said, these ropes are fantastic for fancier shots. Or if you're doctoring or tagging baby calves, when you throw, they're really soft. You can throw a, a really small loop if you need to. Because of the weight, you can really feel the tip and they'll break over on that smaller calf and your catch percentage will go up. They don't have any bounce obviously because they're soft. When it comes to fancy shots they are very very honest whenever you feed into your loop so you can feed rope straight out of your cool hand straight into your loop and make your loop as big as you need to without a figure eight. As they break in those ropes are really really good for that. They want to drape around the animal so when you go to throw any sort of turnover, hip shot, uh, karate chop, any of those type loops are very drapey loops so your rope wants to drape over the animal and then shoot through underneath. These are fantastic ropes for that. If, uh, if we're going to town to a big loop roping, these are typically the ropes we're going to take when it comes to polys. The Senkos have got a place in your bag as far as being a tool for bigger drapier shots if you're practicing big loop shots or if you're tagging baby calves or if you just like a soft rope in general they can do any job you want to want they they come in a 9 5 10 and a 10 5 and an 11 0 so they're big enough to to do any job you want to strong enough and they're a super good poly when it, when we're talking about Senkos and we're talking about a four strand they're unique ropes simply because the strands of lead do not run through the individual strands themselves they are twisted around the lead core so this rope does not does have a core it does not have it's not going to alligator or rattlesnake with you as far as the strand popping out they've kind of got a different feel than your three strands they are very very soft ropes but these ropes have got 
a little bit of a uh, little bit of hidden body in them so if you're gonna go throw a, uh, a hip shot with them when you throw it that top strand is just not gonna fall straight to the ground it's gonna go and, and hang open for you the way I kind of describe these ropes is they're kind of gummy so they've got a really good feel they are smoother to the touch than a three strand but that's kind of a Senko four strand they're they're really really popular ropes other thing with this shamrock if you're a beginner or you know you're working on your fancier shots it's it's such a brightly covered colored rope you can really see what the rope's doing when it hits so you can kind of troubleshoot yourself based on looking at the rope too so anyways that's four strand senko they come in cayman pit viper and shamrock so they're really good ropes Okay, now we're on to the uh, absolute working man's poly. When it comes to an everyday using rope, the Wooza brand is, is the way to go. These are three and four strand polys. These, these ropes are built to work. They've got weight and they age really well. If you're dallying on a slick horn, they don't flake and barb, they melt solid. If you're dallying on rubber, you're not gonna know the difference. They still age well. So they come in a 9-0, a 9-4, and then we do have bigger sizes when it comes to the citation. We'll talk about that in a minute. When it comes to a 9-0, our black and white speckled is definitely our best seller. This rope has tons of weight. It is a three strand. And usually when a guy gets a hold of this rope, they don't quit on it just because it doesn't quit on them. Going forward, same material, different color, three strand, 9-5, orange and black speckled. This rope is just as just as good as the black and white speckle it's just a little bigger diameter so if you like a 9.5 or a 9.5 equates to a 3.8 scan in a poly lead core poly that orange and black speckled is a super good rope this is the same rope pretty much three strand uh, lead core in the black this this ropes the same material just a different color as the other two this comes in a nine five as well so those are your standard wooza poly three strands right there so we're going to upgrade just a little bit to the citation the citation is comes in a three and a four strand this would be the performance poly the reason why it's a performance poly is because it's got more strands of filament per strand of rope this is an excellent rope as far as having body for a poly these ropes we kind of point guys that a rope bigger stock bulls cows stuff like that towards this rope because it's an extremely strong rope it's uh, very durable does not flake and barb if you're dialing on a slick horn and it would be one of our best performance polys that we've got so this particular rope comes in a 9.5 a 10 10.5 and a 10.75 so you can get this in really big diameters as far as as if you're roping something you know bigger stock this rope will handle anything you that you can throw at it so with that being said takes us to our four strand woozas got the same weighted lead core it's got a smoother feel this comes in a black a gold and it comes in a tan these are really popular four strands if you like a four strand rope typically a four strand fills is a little softer rope than a three strand. The guys who like four strands usually like a softer feeling rope that already kind of feels broke in. Cannot go wrong with the Wooza brand. They're a long lasting rope that wants to go to work for you. Uh, it likes the water, it likes the mud. It maintains its, its integrity through all of that. Just like with all the polys, if it just gets totally covered in mud, you can drop it in the water tank and then just knock it off, comes right back and you really won't even know any difference so anyways the wooza poly very very good rope
Okay, so when it comes to our nylons, we've got a really good line of four and five strand nylons with a braided core. That would be our chaos line. They're really good ropes for pasture roping or the branding trap. We get them in an extra soft and a double extra soft. They come in a 3 8 scant, a 3 8 super scant, an 11 30 seconds, and a 5 16 The way I kind of describe these ropes to a guy is if you get them in an extra soft, they're going to have a little bit of bounce. On the uh, head shot, they're going to stand open from belly to ground on a heel shot. If you get them in a double extra soft, which I, that's my personal favorite, they won't have any bounce on a head shot. So you'll hit, it'll break right over figure eight, but it still stands open. It's got a lot of body for your heel shot in the Brandon Trap or if you're doctoring behind somebody and healing for them. Another good nylon rope or nylon blend is our 65-35 poly nylon blend. They come in a 3 8 scant or a 5 16 So they've got a lot of body for a nylon poly blend and they've got really good weight too. Our other ones are the 88-12. This is a uh, 3 8 scant. This is one of my favorite blends. 88, 12, it ages just like a nylon. It's got really good weight. It's a four strand. It does not have a core. But if I'm going out, if, I, if I'm gonna go to a pasture roping or heading to the Brandon Trap and I want something, it's just gonna be a straight up day where I'm throwing head shots and heel shots, not, not any fancy shots. Just more or less a businessman run. This rope is gonna be one of my favorites to take. It's right, really good weight and body too so this one comes in an extra soft and it doesn't have any bounce on the head shot so you can throw drive straight through it boom it'll break over heel shots open belly to ground and they've just got a really good feel all the way through them they age well they're they're a good long lasting nylon poly blend that's the 88 12 and these are the three colors that they come in so they got a variety variety of colors too Okay, so now we're gonna talk about the wax cottons. This is one of my personal favorites. The wax cottons come in a 5 16 or a 3 8 They are five strand ropes with a nylon core. The cottons come in lengths of 40, 50, and 60 foot, 3 8 We do make a specialty rope out of that rope. It's called the heel and drag, and we tie a custom horn knot in that. That rope usually comes in a 30 or 28 foot for guys that just heal and drag at Brandon's or we'll cut that rope down to a 30 footer put no horn knot in it if you'd like them that way the wax cottons are very unique ropes they have unique colors to them they're a lot of fun to use they have similar weight to a poly but they'll have the body of a nylon. They really cut the wind. If you're gonna lay a heel trap, it's gonna give you body to stand up. If you're gonna throw head shots, you can, they'll hit, break right over. You can throw them a long way, get a lot of distance out of them. They're just a good all around rope. They're one of our longest lasting ropes by far. They do have a little bit of a break in period whenever you get them. It's best to run them around the horn two or three times and then just go to using them. Um, they like to be used really hard. If you don't have a lot of roping to do, these ropes can take a little while to break in and just get really, really feeling good. All you have to do to break them in is basically go to using them. The benefits to these ropes are, are just endless. They last a long time. The wax treatment waterproofs them so you don't have to really worry about moisture affecting these ropes. The wax treatment goes all the way through them. So when we when we treat them, we let them sit and soak. You can unravel these ropes and you'll find that they're they're treated all the way through. I will have to tell you they are super fast around the horn. If you had never used one, when you go to the horn you can stack them on three, four, five turns deep on your horn and still feed rope. So they will run with you and the first time you go to the horn and you don't know that, you may 
come out of that situation thinking, holy cow. So anyways, they're super fun ropes. As they break in and they get really soft, you can throw any fancy shot you want to with them, but it does take time for them to get that way. So these are, these are a lot of fun to have, a lot of fun to use. They're one of my, one of my personal favorites. We do have a, a good assortment of left twist ropes. Unfortunately for you guys out there that are left-handed, it is a right-handed world. So we've got a whole lot more right-handed ropes than we do left-handed ropes, but we'll go through them um, because there's guys out here that swing these things. So we've got in our Wooza brand, we have got a uh, four strand black and white speckled 9.5. It's a very popular left twist rope. We've got a three strand gold in a left twist, which this is one of the best feeling polys. Uh, I wish they made this in a right twist because I would dang sure use it. But both of these ropes have a leaded core and they both have good body for poly, especially this particular three strand. We also have it in, they come in a white as well as far as the woozas go. The Senko brand, we've got this in the red, white, and blue three strand. It's got the weighted core in it. And then we also carry the four strand Pit Viper in a left twist too. And these are real popular ropes for guys that like to throw fancier shots or they like a softer rope in general. When it comes to the polys, that's what we offer in a left twist. We also have one nylon. This is a three strand, three eight scant, extra soft, this rope is gonna have some bounce on a head shot so it's got quite a lot of body but it's gonna stand open for for heel shots they age really good this is a straight nylon and they've got a lot of good weight just a solid solid nylon for a, a left twist rope Thanks for watching the video. Hope that helps out on uh, maybe some questions that you might have on how we pick out ranch ropes and the jobs we use them for as far as ordering online. Check us out at Facebook, Instagram, or on our website, 310ranchlife.com. Get you one today. Thank you. Thank you.